What's up, YouTube world? I want to talk to you guys today about the exciting new world of Virginia Beach. I've moved my line business to the Virginia Beach area, which includes seven cities. It includes uh, Williamsburg up north. Next, it includes the fine city of Newport News, uh, Hampton Roads. It also includes places like Norfolk, uh, Suffolk, Chesapeake, and our fine city of Virginia Beach. So it's exciting to service these uh, seven cities. I'm going to start out with the uh, first four. I forgot Portsmouth. We service Portsmouth as well. Oh my goodness, I forgot him. Um, so we got the, the Portsmouth area. We got Chesapeake, Virginia Beach, Suffolk, and Norfolk. Those are the five cities I'm going to start servicing right away. And after that, we're going to be very excited to grow our business. We're going to grow our business, hopefully by over 250 properties this year. Hey, see, Scott, how are you going to do that? Well, we're going to start by marketing. Marketing is the answer to all new businesses. You may have lived in Ohio. You may have lived in uh, Florida. You may have lived in the D.C. area. It doesn't matter where you live. It, it's how you market the people, contact people, let them know who you are and what you do and how that you can help them. And once you have all that squared away, guess what? You're ready to rock and roll to grow your business. I'm going to be, I've listened to people like Jonathan Potoshnik, Lawn Care Millionaire, uh, Stanley Genetic, multi, multi, uh, I think he's a millionaire too, with multiple businesses that are worth millions of dollars. Um, Keith Kelfis, uh, he's a six figure earner for his business. Lawn Care Rookie, uh, Lawn Care Nut down there in Tampa, Clearwater, Florida area. Um, Family lawn and landscape and lawn care, or how we say, it. I listen to him. Um, George, uh, Brian up in Michigan, um, Johnny Mose in Pennsylvania, Pittsburgh area, north. Uh, I want to see northwest of Pittsburgh. Um, there's a bunch of people I listen to and watch, and you know, it's just out of the boredom, just out of boredom. I got time on lawnmower. Have some headsets on, listening until the customer calls. I stop listening. I answer that phone. I uh, turn the mower off. Go get all the information I need about them. Give them a fast and friendly quote. Get right back with them. Sometimes you have to go to the house, so you get the contact information. You get the address. Show up at their house. Uh, at an appointment, designated time and all that, answer all their questions, give them a, a fast and friendly offer. It's always about an opportunity. You're giving the customer an opportunity to tell you no. You always ask for the business. Don't worry about what they think. Who cares what they think most of the time? You, you know I mean? As long as you're satisfying their needs and their wants, that's what matters. You're fast and friendly about it. And you do a quality job. You do it on time and within the budget they give you. Uh, sometimes you can work things out where it, it's a little bit more, but really it's... You say this is within budget or, you, you know, you get the idea. You ask, you qualify. You always pre-qualify your, your customer. You don't want to lead them down a road where they can't handle it. You know, like, what's the point of charging beyond their budget you know then you don't get paid then you go out of business and they complain to a hundred other customers always take care of your customer be good to your customers if you like this video give it the big old thumbs up like and subscribe and spread the word thanks again